Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm gonna talk about a very exciting topic, how to build your own e-commerce website for free. In this video, I'll show you how to create your online store without spending a single penny. I'll also tell you why I personally use Shopify instead of one of the free platforms I'll be mentioning, but I'll be getting into that soon. And if at any point you decide to check out Shopify, click the link in the description to get a deal of a dollar per month for the first three months, along with a free three-day free trial, which you won't be able to get by going directly to their website. So take advantage of it while it lasts. Now, before we get started, I'll go over the benefits of having an e-commerce website. Online shopping is very popular these days, and by having your own online store, you'll be able to reach an international audience, sell your products or services 24-7, and take advantage of its convenience and flexibility. With the right strategies, you can turn your e-commerce website into a really profitable business. Now, the entire process of website building is really straightforward. All you have to do is follow a few steps, which I'm gonna get into right now. The first step for building your free e-commerce website is choosing the right platform. Luckily, there are several options available that offer free plans with robust features. You can choose from Squarespace, Weebly, WooCommerce, etc. All these are free open source and offer various customization options. Next, it's time to set up your store. You'll be asked to sign up for an account and follow the platform's instructions. And then it's time to choose a theme or a template for your website. Pick one that makes sense for your brand's identity. And remember, a minimal user-friendly design is important for positive user experience. In order to make your website stand out, customize your chosen theme by adding your logo, changing colors, and adjusting fonts to suit your design. Don't forget to create informative pages like an About Us page, product descriptions, and contact information. Now, what else does a store need? products, of course, so now it's time to add services you offer or products to the website. For that, take high quality photos and then write engaging descriptions mentioning prices, sizes, or any special features. Be sure to organize your products into categories to make navigation easier for customers. And once you're done with that, you'll want to set up payment options. WooCommerce, Wix, Weebly, Square, etc. all offer multiple options including PayPal and Stripe, but you need to make sure that the payment process is secure and user-friendly to build customer trust. And after you've set up payment gateways, the next step is to figure out shipping. Most e-commerce platforms provide integration with popular shipping carriers, which help you calculate shipping costs and generate shipping labels. And you can also set up free shipping options for specific products and offer promotions to attract more customers. Okay, so now you're finished building your e-commerce website. Many platforms let you do all this absolutely free. While these websites may provide you with the basics for free, they do come with many limitations and constraints. You know, as your business grows, you might want to have better features such as different payment options or detailed analytics. But here's the thing, handling all that on a free website can get tough and really kind of impossible. Most free websites don't even offer such features at all. So my advice to you is to just think it through and do some research before choosing any platform. Sure, a free option might save you money at first, but in the long run, you'll be limited by the few features, especially if you're going to want to scale your business. Now, that explains why I chose Shopify for my own e-commerce website. The free platforms just weren't offering all that I wanted or needed for my business, and that's when I really began to do my research. After a while, I finally found Shopify with all the features I was looking for. My personal experience with Shopify has been really great and was the best decision that I think I could have made. They gave me fantastic themes that looked beautiful and were compatible on both desktop and mobile phones automatically. I also really appreciated their 24 seven support that was always there when I needed them. Oh, and they gave me free SSL certificates to keep my website safe and secure. So there's really no need to be concerned about hackers or anything like that. Shopify also made it easy for me to accept payments on my website. I don't need to deal with any third-party services because it was all offered right there with Shopify. They really did make the whole process as simple as possible. And while everything was going well, I was still concerned about shipping. It was just too much to handle as a new business owner. So I tried Shopify's dropshipping option, which offers a range of well-known vendors that'll provide delivery services for your products. This was a game changer and I've been really happy with it since the start. With Shopify's paid plans, you can unlock the full potential of your online store. You gain access to advanced features, expanded customization options, reliable hosting, and exceptional customer support, which are all essential for taking your e-commerce business to the next level. So there you have it. While building your own e-commerce website for free is an option, it's up to you to decide what's the best for your business. 
Whether you go with a free or paid platform, you'll be able to create a successful online store without breaking the bank. If you do decide that you're looking for more features and opportunities to scale, Shopify is definitely the way to go. And remember, if you want to try Shopify, check out the link in the description below to get your first three months for just a dollar per month, as well as a three day free trial. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel for more. And if you have any questions, please drop them in the comment section down below. Guys, thanks so much for watching to the end of this video and I'll see you in the next one.